Welcome back to another tutorial on happy add-ons for Elementor. And in this one, we are looking at the happy particle effect. This is, of course, an add-on for Elementor that can be used in both the free and pro versions. And the best way to understand what the particle effect is all about is to show you. Inside Elementor, we go and you apply the particle effect on a section. So you're going to find the settings for that whenever you go to a section. So we find our section up here, go to style, and you will find happy particle effects here, then under styling. Click on it, and then the first thing you will need to do is to enable the particle background effect. The moment you do that, you will start to see little snowflakes appear. And this style actually, interestingly, is called NASA. And with the drop down, then you will see that you have four options here. The first one that we look at is NASA selected by default. And then polygon gives you that very familiar looking shape. And then snow, which is what I called the previous one, but this is more snow. And then you also have an option for custom. Let's put it back on polygon and talk about this very quickly. Because if you see the polygon shape, you get this sense of familiarity that you've seen this before on websites. That is the first piece of advice I will give you regarding the particle effects. Two, three years ago, it was a hot thing and it was very new. At this moment, it's been maybe a little bit overused. So to avoid falling into that same cliche trap, if you're going to be using it, just use it maybe once or twice on your entire site. Don't overdo it. If you want a little bit more of control apart from the standard setting, just go here to advanced settings. And if you activate this, it will give you control over the number of particles, particle size, movement speed, and even enable hover effect. And if polygon is not your style, you go for NASA. And that's again, those maybe stars or galaxies. That's why they refer to it as NASA or snow. But you're probably then interested in what is custom. If you've worked with particle effects before in Elementor, because there are actually quite a number of plugins and add-ons that do allow for particle effects within Elementor, you will know that you can get some of these effects as a JSON download file. And that's what this area here at the bottom is for. Where to find that? If you read here, visit a link here. And as you hover with the cursor over here, you will see it turns into the hand, which allows you to click it. Click it, it opens another tab in your browser. And if you've never worked with this area before, look at it like a sandbox. Come in there like a kid who's standing on the outside, coming to the sandbox and trying to figure out what the hey is going on here. So you can see there's a few features up here and you see by default it has NASA and there's also snow. And then there's another one also called bubble. So let's say we're going to stick to this bubble. And what you do is you start with one of these presets and then under that you start playing around with these parameters over here. And there's a lot. There's the number, the color, the shape, the size. So if I just go to size, you see it's already set at 160. So if I reduce it, it's going to make those little hexagons smaller. And if I want to make it larger, there you go. And there's a lot. You have random here, which means that if I enable it, it's going to give me hexagons at random sizes. And that's what you're going to be doing for all of these guys over here. Then when you're done, go over here. Don't get fooled by the download button there. You go to this one here that says download current config JSON and click on JSON and let it download. After you have downloaded, open Notepad. I'll grab the JSON file that's downloaded, drag it into Notepad. And from here, control command A to select everything and then control command C. Go back to Elementor and in this area here, control command V. And then look there, I've brought in that. That looks a little bit complicated, but if that got the better of you, just go back and watch it again. Download the file, bring it into Notepad, and then copy it there and paste it there within this area over here. Warning time again, warning time again. Don't go overboard. And that's it. That is Happy Particle Effects from Happy Add-ons for Elementor. For more videos like that, and to find out what's going on in the world of WordPress in general, please subscribe to our channel here at Websites for Beginners. From me, JP, have a great day. Stay safe. See you next time.